Yeah, look, uh, the, the best money saving uh, moves you can achieve with uh, doing your own home would be to plan out what sort of sheet sizes you're going to require for the areas you're covering. So for argument's sake, if you have wall spans that you can capture with one sheet, then you want to minimise the joints because that will obviously minimise the labour component for the stocking, So, which you'll be paying your contractor for. So the idea is to plan out your uh, installation and order the sheet sizes accordingly. So even the width of the sheet will vary as well. So you might have a 1350 width, say, and you're trying to cover a, a 2.7 ceiling, you only need two sheets. So there's no cuts, there's no extra work involved. So Be smart with what you're ordering in, yes. minimise the amount of labour and cutting and prepping yourself so you can just put it on basically and, and yeah. not stress too much. And what about if you're working, working with maybe two people and only a six metre sheet, it's probably a three person hang as novices. Yep. Could you get different sizes? Or what, yeah, the look, that, and that's the thing, depending on how many friends you can uh, invite over. So I suppose the idea would be to to plan out again the type of installation you want to do, the areas. If you've only got two people, then you might need to downsize the, the sheet because obviously the, the, the longer it is, the heavier it is. So work within your own capacity, let's say. So if, if you've only got one other person, you might have to order a shorter sheet. It might have a little bit more joints, but at the end of the day, you've got to do what's safe and, and reasonable. And you can do the bulk of the hand yourself as well. Absolutely. Yeah.